The breath is like a mirror for the mind. As John Lee says, if the mirror is normal and flat, then you can see your true reflection. If it gets abnormal, your body either gets stretched out so it's thin and long, or else squ squashed down so it's fat and short. You can't see things for what they are. So try to make your breath normal. Feels normal for the body breathing in, normal for the body breathing out. And that way, when any abnormalities come up, it's like a defilement detector. You can sense something's going on in the mind. And it's good to have a detector like this, because all too often greed or aversion and delusion get started in the mind, and they start out very qu quietly. They're very small. And we're looking someplace else. Or like the chairman of a corporation who lets his workers make all the decisions while he goes around and travels here, travels there, never spends much time in the factory. And so they start manufacturing all kinds of weird things. So you want to be here. This should be your mirror to look at your corporation on every level. So when some strange decision gets made, you know immediately something's up, and then you can look into it. At the same time, you're living with a sense of well-being, and so the mind is not quite so hungry to go out for unskillful things. That's the other reason we go for unskillful thoughts, is we're hungry. Something comes along and offers a little entertainment, a little spice. We say, I've been missing some good food for a while, so let's take this, whatever it is. And then it turns out that it's the nourishment in the defilement is all in the spicing. And there's nothing else there. So feed the mind well with the breath and make it normal. So, as I said, so that when abnormalities show up, your defilement detector can sense them and do something about them. This way you go through life informed about the part of your awareness that should be most important. In other words, what's going on in your mind. We spend so much time looking at the news outside, we neglect to look at the news inside. We're not up on current events. So use this mirror to look at yourself. Make sure the mirror is clean and normal and flat. That way you'll be able to see even little things very clearly.